Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I have today's grocery haul and meal plan. Let's start over here and I will tell you what my meal plan is. So I have a low carb taco pie. This is different than the low carb taco casserole that I've made before. I will have it linked down below. I have made it once or twice before. I'm going to be doing a chicken alfredo with broccoli and cauliflower. I don't know if I have a recipe for this. Um, I will find one and link it down below, but mine will be a little bit different. Then I'm going to be doing a broccoli cheese stuffed chicken. I'm going to be doing a cabbage roll casserole and then blue cheeseburgers on a, a smart bun. Okay, so I needed some ground beef for um, a couple of those recipes and other ones. I didn't really have a plan for this, but it was on sale for $1.99, so I went ahead and just picked it up. This is the just the ground turkey. And then they also had this on sale for 30% off. This is just some um, chicken sliced up. I thought this would be good for lunches. I could just um, grill them all up at one time and just have them for lunches throughout the week. I did pick up some Bang, Bang Energy drinks. I got the Key Lime Pie, two of the Power Punch, and one of the Purple Guava Pear. Picked up a few yogurts. I have two of the Mango, two of the Black Cherry, and one of the Coconut. Got some sugar-free whipped heavy cream. I'll be using this for some coffees that I have, um, some like holiday themed coffees I will be sharing with you soon. Heavy cream, I needed that for that low carb taco pie, half and half for coffee and those coffee drinks. Cream cheese is going to be, I believe part of it is going to be for that stuffed chicken. And then I also need it for my Alfredo sauce. Cottage cheese just for breakfast or lunch. Uh, pico de gallo for the taco pie. Guacamole also for the taco pie. I needed some more um, low carb bread, so I picked up the Franz. Also needed some more tortillas. Um, this is gonna be before my lunches. I do plan on doing like, I don't know, some kind of burritos or something for my lunches. I have a lot of holiday recipes coming up for you and I needed some more of the Lily's Peppermint Flavor Baking Chips for a couple of the recipes. So stay tuned for those during Vlogmas. I picked up two of those. And if you are looking for these in your Walmart, my Walmart does not keep any of the specialty flavored like holiday edition ones in the baking aisle. They are in like a special end cap with, with all the holiday stuff. That's where I found both the pumpkin and the peppermint. And then finally produce. So I always pick up the um, jalapeno, like the stuffed peppers. So I just put these in my air fryer, but they have cream cheese, cheese, and bacon on top. Uh, baby spinach and butter lettuce. I wanna try to eat more salads this week. Cucumbers for snacking, a green onion for salads, avocados to go with any of my meals. Needed a head of cabbage for that cabbage casserole. A couple of red bell peppers. Um, one of them is going to be for the stir fry, one for the stuffed um, chicken with the broccoli. Green bell peppers, I needed those just for snacking. And the orange bell pepper, I think this is going to be for the, oh, I think one green and one orange is going to be for the cabbage casserole. I picked up some broccoli for that stuffed chicken and then the broccoli and cauliflower for that Alfredo. I like to have shredded lettuce on my chicken sandwiches and also on top of that taco pie. And then because I just, I like to have like chopped salad with my regular like butter, lettuce and spinach. So I did pick up a couple of these. I don't use the dressing with them typically because typically I don't really like them, but I also don't. This one is the Chipotle cheddar. Um, it does have Chipotle ranch dressing, sharp cheddar cheese, and the tortilla strips. Um, this actually is pretty carb friendly. It's seven net carbs for one and a half cups, and that's if you use everything. So I don't think the dressing on this one is too bad. And then the pomegranate is pomegranate vinaigrette dressing, the dried cranberries, and flax seeds. And this one, I believe, is 13 net carbs. And that's probably because of the dressing, I imagine. And that is everything. So I will have all of those meals linked down below. Stay tuned for lots of holiday recipes coming up and also a what's for dinner coming up probably next week with all of these meals plus more. And I will see you guys then. Bye guys.